So we won't be flying crew, we'll be flying some mannequins and some torsos that are simulated human tissue and organs that are looking at radiation protection, radiation environment, the acceleration of the, the vehicle and how that affects the human body because our goal is for the crewed flight on Artemis too. The most physically demanding is the spacewalk training. It's like running a marathon twice, but on your hands, and uh, at least for space station I, I, EVAs. And then the most spiritually or emotionally challenging is this time away from family. Hold the front of it. It's easier to do it underhand, and you've got to time it like a fishing pole, you know, to let off the buttons. Our sights are not set on the moon. Our sights are set clearly on Mars. And everything that you're thinking about today, everything that we're going to do on Artemis 1, Artemis 1 leads to Artemis 2, which leads to Artemis 3, when we hope to have humans on the surface of the moon. But Artemis 3 is leading to the rest of the Artemis program. Uh, the first woman, the first person of color on the surface of the moon, and then the first humans tracking out to Mars and putting our footsteps in building science laboratories and, and inhabiting another, another planet.